With Writer, I can save drafts of my blog posts and continue working on them later. There are two ways to save a draft. Clicking on the Save button will save a draft directly to my computer. The draft is saved into a folder under My Documents called My Weblog Posts. This is useful when I want to work on a blog post when I'm not connected to the Internet. I can also drop down the Save button and save a draft online. This will save a draft of my post to my blog service so that I can open it in Writer from another computer. To open a draft or to modify a post I already published, I can click on the Open button and use the Open dialog to browse to the post I want and open it. I like to categorize my blog posts under different topics, and I can do this in the Properties tray at the bottom of the window. Because I often forget to do this, I've set an option in Writer to remind me to set the category on the post if I try to publish it without one. It's also possible to preview what my post will look like on the blog before it's published. To do this, I use the View menu to switch into Preview mode. Now that I'm ready to publish, it's as simple as pressing the Publish button. When Writer is finished publishing, it will open my post in a browser window where I can see the final result. I can also print my posts in Writer. The other day, I wrote a blog about my daughter's first soccer goal. We were all so proud of her that we wanted to print the story and hang it on our fridge. I did this by choosing Print on the File menu. Writer has many resources for getting more information from the Help menu. Windows Live Writer Help. That includes support topics for the most common features in Writer. Send Feedback, which lets you send anonymous, one-way feedback to the Windows Live Writer team. Support enables you to receive email support from the product team. Community forums and developers, which are public forums where you can talk to other writer users and the writer product teams about issues you're having with other topics. Writer team blog. This is where you can stay up to date with what's going on with the product and get tips on how to use features. Now you should feel ready to open Writer and start publishing to your blog. Thanks for using Windows Live Writer.